Hey everyone! Today, I'm diving into a remarkable piece of history that many might not know about, how Armenia became the first Christian nation in the world. This is a story not just of faith, but also of power, struggle, and identity. Let's set the scene. The year is 301 AD. To the west, the Roman Empire is gradually embracing Christianity under Constantine the Great. However, a small landlocked country in the Caucasus region, Armenia, is about to make history. Armenia, at this time, is under the rule of King Tiridates III. The king, initially a pagan, is influenced by a man named Gregory the Illuminator. Gregory had been previously imprisoned by Tiridates for his unwavering Christian beliefs, but legend has it, after surviving a series of tortures, Gregory cures Tiridates of a severe disease which the pagan priests couldn't heal. This miracle leads to a transformative moment for Tiridates and for Armenia. Moved by Gregory's faith and his miraculous recovery, King Tiridates converts to Christianity. But he doesn't stop there. In a bold move, he declares Christianity as the state religion of Armenia. This is groundbreaking because it's almost a decade before Rome adopts Christianity officially. Now why does this matter? Armenia's conversion establishes it as a pivotal player in the Christian world. Monasteries and churches sprout throughout the land, becoming centers of not only religion, but also learning and culture. The invention of the Armenian alphabet by St. Mesrop Mashtots in 405 AD further strengthens this, enabling the spread of Christian literature in the vernacular. Fast forward to today, and you can see the profound impact of this decision. Christianity is deeply woven into the fabric of Armenian identity. The country's landscape is dotted with ancient churches and monasteries, some of which are UNESCO World Heritage Sites, standing as a testimony to Armenia's pioneering role in Christian history. So, Armenia's journey to becoming the first Christian nation is not just a testament to its leader's faith, but also a pivotal moment that shaped the cultural and historical path of the nation for centuries to come. Thanks for joining me on this historical deep dive. If you found this fascinating, don't forget to like, share, and subscribe for more insights into history's intriguing corners. See you next time.